Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. As I was broadcasting this live TLDR episode, the Locker Room Daily Report, as I do every weekday at 3 p.m. or somewhere thereabouts, had a question come in from Lisa M. Card, who is a regular viewer of our live stream. And she asks, do you recommend an all wireless home office? Uh, yes, I do. You know, there are times when you want to be connected directly uh, to some kind of physical router. You know, if you're pushing a lot of data back and forth and you can't get a, a very good wireless signal where you happen to be uh, sitting, that is, is sometimes the practical way to go. But as time has moved on, I have become more and more wireless with the devices. Whereas I used to plug everything in, I would much rather have fewer cords and cables strewn about the home office. That would make me so happy. You have no idea. Uh, and, and this doesn't make much sense until you start getting more gadgets and gizmos. Do you know how many USB devices I used to have connected to one of my uh, computers? It was like seven or eight. And eventually I started uh, you know, getting rid of them. I think I only have one two USB devices connected to a computer right now, a, a, a webcam and a wired keyboard as a backup for the wireless keyboard, but I have a wireless mouse, wireless keyboard, my printer, which I reviewed before, uh, the Epson Workforce 840, fully wireless. I can access it from you know anywhere in the house. And I think the more wireless you are, I think the happier you're going to be. Not to say that you need to replace everything that's wired today with something wireless, but yeah, I, I absolutely believe that a wireless office is a happier office because there's far less clutter to have to deal with. And that is probably enemy number one as far as I'm concerned is, is cord and cable clutter.